okay so let me start so yesterday what we have learned so we have learned so number of sides name of polygon okay so three sides it is called triangle so four side it is called quadrilateral okay so five side pentagon six hexagon seven septagon sorry heptagon eight is octagon and nine is uh, nonagon ten is decagon okay that was that must we have learned and next thing what we have learned next thing what we have learned was so in uh, interior angle of regular polygon okay so interior angle of regular polygon was n minus 2 okay so into 180 divided so 180 degree divided by n it was the formula of interior angle of regular polygon okay yesterday you have solved that one also okay so i am very proud to see you all okay so your answers okay so it was all right so some answers were incorrect so i have told to solve that one also recorrect that one also and next one is sum of interior angle of polygon okay n minus 2 into 180 degree okay so that was the formula yesterday that we have learned n minus 2 into 180 degree so today mostly we are going to use this formula sum of interior angle of polygon that means n minus 2 into 180 degree okay this formula we are going to use and we need to you know this one also okay so eight side means what seven sides means what 10 side means what and how to use to calculate that into formula okay how to convert that into formula that also we need to know it okay so let us go to our topics so due to some construction work so some disturbance may come from the background okay so sorry for the disturbance Okay, so let me. This was all yesterday's work that we have done it. Okay, so let us do it today's work. So solve. Not exactly the solve. It's written like this. Question. Question number one. What does it mean? Okay, so question, find the missing value. Okay, so let me make some of the figures. Suppose this is the figure. Okay, and here, Suppose this one at number chapter this this laptop Can't you move it, right? Can't you move it? So, all the students can hear, my dear, please be quiet or be out of the group. Be quiet. Okay, so look at here. So look at the figure. So 85 degrees given, 105 degrees given, 965 degrees given, and X is given. Okay. 
and we need to find out the value of x. So in case of triangle, uh, we know that. So in case of triangle, the sum of angle of a triangle is equal to 180 degree. Okay, so sum of angle of a triangle is equal to 180 degree. Triangle ko charting the side line plus square money, it becomes 180 degree. But if there are four sides, then what do we call it? What is it? Having a four sides, what do we call it? Quadrilateral. We call it the quadrilateral. Quadrilateral. Okay, so this is a quadrilateral. So in case of quadrilateral, so let us write down the number of sides first. Number of sides. How many sides are they all together? Four. There are four sides. Okay, so let us find out the sum of this angle first. Sum of interior angle of quadrilateral. Sum of angle of a quadrilateral. What is the formula of this one? It is n minus 2 into 180 degree. So please solve it. So what is the value of n? How many sides are there? There are four sides. Minus two. Into 180 degree. Hmm. Then after that. So it costs you 2 into 180 degree. That means it is going to be called Thomas. It is going to be called a 360 degree. Uh, wait a minute. It is going to be called a 360 degree. 360. So it all has come down. Let me write this. Okay. Then after that, so this is 85, this is 105 degrees. So this is 65 degrees, this is x. Okay, please copy this question, okay? So because I need to erase this one. So 985, 105, 65, and x. So number of side is 4, sum of interior angle of a quadrilateral. That means if we add all these angles, it is going to be how much? It is going to be 360 degrees. Okay, so it is going to be 360 degree. So, now let us find out the missing value. Now, now, so what is the value? So 85 degree. Let us add all this angle. 85, this is 105. Okay, so it has been shifted. Please adjust this one. Okay, 85 is there. This is 105 degree, this is 65 degree, and this is X. So now let us add this all. So 85 degree. 85 plus 105 plus, so 65 plus X. Okay, so if we add all these angles, then it is going to be called to 360 degree. Please write on the sign of degree also. Okay, so I'm using the laptop over here, so I cannot write on the angle. I need some time for this one. Okay, so let us add all this one. 85 plus 105 plus 65, it is going to be called to ours. 85, 105, 65. So 85 
and 105 it is going to be 190 and 190 plus 65 it is going to be equal to 200 and how much 255 255 just write on the sign of degree also in each value it cross to 360 and this 100 255 it goes that side so that means x is equal to 360 minus, minus 255 and ultimately x mm. will be equal to so 360 minus 255 it becomes 105 degree so this is going to be our answer okay so write down angle in all the sides Just do it quickly. Is there any problem? No, sir. Okay. So let me give you the next question then. So suppose there are Not exactly with this one. So one. Let me draw five lines. Okay, now two, three, four. And five. Okay, so here yeah, so there are all together five lines. Pentagon. Okay, so this is equal to 125. Please do yourself, okay? So this is 125. Yes, sir. So this is 135. 135 degree. This is 150. Yes, sir. Uh, this is so this looks 100 degree. And this thing you need to find out X. Just do yourself. So first of all, find out the sum of interior angle of a triangle, sorry, of a poly pentagon. Okay, the name of this one is pentagon because how many sides are there? One, two, three, four, five, five, five sides are there. That means it is pentagon. And write on number of sides equals to, okay, something, something, whatever we have done just before. So number of sides, five, so sum of interior angle of a pentagon. So pentagon, okay, so find out the uh, value of this one and add all this one and get the answer quickly. Finished?
Finished? So what is the measure of the sum of angle of pentagon? Uh, don't 540. Flip the paper. 540. 540. And add all this angle. So 125 plus 135 plus 150 plus uh, 100 degree plus X. Add all this angle. 125, 135, 150, 100 and X. Add all this angle. So their sum must be equal to? 30 degrees. 30. So our answer is 30 degrees. 30 degrees. Okay. So sum of angle of interior angle is almost 514? Yes, sir. That means the answer is 30 degree, isn't it? Yes, sir. Okay, all of you got the answer? Yes, yeah. yes sir. Okay, then let me go for the next question then. Let me clear everything this one. Okay, so let me increase the number of sites now. Okay, so tell me how many sides are there all together? The seven. Okay, so the one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. There are seven sides all together. Okay, and if there are seven sides, then what do we call it? Heptagon. We call it heptagon. Okay, so keep on calculating the sum of the interior angle of, a tri of this heptagon. Okay, so I'll keep on writing the question over here. So let it be 60 degree. This is 150. Uh, let me say this as 170 degree. 165 degree. Uh, please got the disturbance. When you are be in the silent room, Nani So 175. One. Fifty-five. This is X. Okay, this is X. Okay, tell me, what is the value of this one? Some inter angle of uh, heptagon is how much? Nine hundred. Okay, so add all this one and get a value of x. So sum of angle of heptagon is equal to nine hundred, and add this one all, and get the answer. The answer is going to be twenty-five degree.
So what is the value of x? 25. Okay. So 25 is the answer. So not only x, but there is y also now. So how will you get the value of y? How can we get the value of y? x plus 1, y is equal to 180 degree. x plus oh. y equals to 180 degree. Why? Straight angle. Straight angle. Yeah. Straight angle. It, is a, it is a straight angle, right? So after getting the value of x, so x in the next line, so write them, okay, again, or as you can write them now, or as you can write them any word, okay, then, or any word, okay, so this type of word we write on to make a gap, okay, so that we can uh, distribute, we can divide the two solutions. After getting the value of x, write down anything like then, again, or something else, I need to x plus y equals to 180 degree. Why x plus y equals 180 degree? Because it is, a, it is a straight angle. X plus Y equals to 180 degree. Okay. Because it is a straight angle. All of you get the value of X? Yes, sir. So first of all, we need to get the value of the of this one. Okay, there are seven sides. Don't count this side. Eh? This is not a figure. This is an extra line. If in the question this line is given, then somebody they counts in this way one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and this one is eight. No, this is not eight. Kota kota just join, join. Why does it kati or the side by side? This is the extra line. You can see over here. This is the extra line. Don't count the extra line. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That is not seven lines are there. And out of seven lines, so this is the heptagon and heptagon ko sides nikalne. So angles nikalne. Sum of angles of Heptagon. So it becomes 900, honey. So add all this one. So it becomes, you'll get the value of x, 25 degree. After that, x plus y equals to 180 degree. x plus y equals to 180 degree. And this is why it is 180 because it is a straight line. And a straight line, why see? Get the value of y. So what is the value? What is the answer? 100 and? 55. 55 degrees is the answer. All of you got the answer? Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. So no need to find out the angle, sum of angle of a triangle. I am going to make the next question in this one only. Sum. Okay, so here, suppose this is. One hundred five degree. You are asked to find out the value of this one. X. Now how will you find out? Okay, so no need to find out the, the that one sum of angle of heptagon because we have already found in the previous question itself. Okay, so this also the heptagon one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven sides are there. Don't count these extra lines. Okay, so this is out of this heptagon. So your uh, joint figure line matter count gane. Your this is the extra line. Okay, so do not count this one. So this is an extra line drawn from here from this line. Okay, so let me not count this one. Uh, so how will you get the value of x? This is our problem. How to get the value of x? Any idea? How can we get the value of x? One fifty, sixty, one seventy five, one fifty five, hundred five, and one sixty five ang uh, angles are given, and we need to get the value of x, which is outside the heptagon. How will you get this? So, this is not the alternate angle because there is no parallel lines over here. So what we need to do? 
we need to make an angle we need to suppose this as angle as a okay so let us suppose this as angle as a we cannot suppose x because x is the position for us okay we can write on y z anything like anything okay so there are 26 alphabets if there is x already let us write on the remaining 25 we can write on anything if your name starts from s you can write on s okay so okay a let us write on a so a plus 155 plus 60 plus 175 155 105 plus 165 add all this one we cannot get this x directly okay so let us find out the value of this one first a let us find out the value of a after getting the value of a then only we can get the value of x okay so let us find out the value of a first how much you will get after getting the value of a then only we can get the value of x So we just have 10 minutes left now. Please do quickly. Your answer is 90-90. A is also 90. X is also 90. Is it the answer? A is 174. Is it 90-90? A is also. No? So what is the value of A then? 170. 170. How oh, 170? 150 plus 60. 10 will be the. Heptagon means the sum must be called. Sir, like answer ninety. Okay. Oh. Yes, the value of A is nine. Yes, ninety ninety. Did you get the answer? Yes, sir. Okay, so everything is erased. 900, so 90, and uh, so this x will also be equal to 90, okay, because it's straight angle. So a is 90 means a plus x equals to 9. So a, a plus x will be equal to 180 degree, uh, and in the region item being a straight angle. Okay, and get the value of x. x is also equal to 90 degree. Okay, so almost the time is up. Please be quick. If you have any, any problem, please ask me. Is so we problem? have to join again. No, no. So time is almost up. Okay, so I'll send you the work, homework. Please solve it yes. and send it to me. Yes, okay. sir. Uh, Otherwise, you can turn your page, uh, I don't know the page number, so you can turn your book, okay? So there is, so right now I don't have the book, it is in the school. Okay, so you can see a book, okay? So this type of numericals are given, mm, polynomials, something is there, okay? So this, this chapter is there. So please turn it in the geometry session only in the in, in the beginning of the copy only. So this type of numerical is given. So keep on solving it. If you don't know, click it and send it to me. I'll solve it. I'll send it to you if you, if you have any problem. Okay. Did you see that answer question? In your book, please. please tell me the page number. Hello. 